Hi friends, today we are going to learn how to create a variable product in WooCommerce. Well, it's quite easy to create such products which have multiple options to select. The three steps are create attributes like color, size, etc. Second step would be create a variable product and add already created attributes in that product. And the third step would be create variation images, prices, etc. And your variable product is ready. So let's proceed. Firstly, we need to move on to the products tab and then attributes. All right, here we'll add the attribute name like color. Add attribute in the same way size. Add attribute. Now the two attributes have already been added color and size now we have to put the colors like black blue yellow or size small medium large so here i'm going to create two uh, options black and yellow just need to click on this settings icon next to the color all right here it is asking to add new color we just need to put here uh, black you can put your own color also add new color in the same way yellow add new color so the two colors have been added into the colors tab in the same way we'll create the sizes small and medium just need to click on this settings icon again here we'll put a small and medium okay so we have two sizes small and medium now the first step has been done that's create attributes that's done now second step is create a variable product and add already created attributes so let's move on to add a new product here we'll put the name of the product that's t-shirt now the most important thing that you need to take care of is just uh, check this product data by default it shows simple product here you have to select variable product now here we'll create a sample SKU ID now second step is go on to the attributes tab here we'll see in the drop down list color and size is already added just need to click on color and hit add here we have already created two attributes for color that's black and yellow you just need to click on select all it will show here and hit used for variations in the same way we have to select size and then select all and used for variations just save it all right it's done so second step is already completed we have already created a variable product and added already created attributes in that product that's done now third step is create variation images and prices so let's move on to variations tab now here we need to select create variations from all attributes that is color and sizes hit go hit ok four variations have been added WooCommerce have a very good functionality that it automatically arranges the uh, all possible number of variations in a proper sequence like you can see here black medium black small yellow medium yellow small now when we click on this tab it will show the black medium options we need to upload an image for this variation just hit this icon and here's the black one set variation image we need to put here the price ten dollars or you can put your own prices in the same way we need to select here black small size same t-shirt for small size i'll put five dollars and just like a black option you can also put for yellow and medium i have done it now we need to hit save changes it has been saved now these are the variation things we have already been added now we have to set a primary image for this product 
so we need to click on the set product image I'm selecting here blue all right now the last step is just hit publish all right so our variable product is ready now let's check our product on the live view here we go we can see here uh, this is the variable product that we have recently created just need to select any one of them uh, like we are selecting black option and size would be small we can see image changes as black and size for uh, the price for the small size is five dollars in the same way if we select medium price changes ten dollars if we select yellow color and small price is forty dollars for medium price is fifty dollars so uh, it's, it's quite very easy to create a variable product in woocommerce hope uh, you people enjoyed this video and for more tutorials please subscribe to our youtube channel bye bye have a great day